हेलो ऑल एंड टुडे वी विल लुक आउट ऑन हाउ टू स्टार्ट एंड स्टॉप ई सी टू इंस्टेंसेज विथ लैमडा सर्वर सो ई सी टू इज फॉर आवर कंप्यूट सर्वर विच वी हैव टू डिप्लॉय फॉर सम स्पेसिफिक यूज केसेस एंड दिस इंक्लूड्स सम ऑफ चार्जेस सो फर्स्ट सेवन हंड्रेड आवर्स आर जस्ट फ्री ऑफ यूजेस एंड फॉर लैमडा इट्स अ सर्वर लेस सो वी हैव टू लिंक ई सी टू इंस्टेंसेस टू लैमडा सो वी कैन ऑटोमेटिकली इट कैन स्टार्ट एंड स्टॉप एट द गिवेन अ स्पेसिफिक टाइम सो आफ्टर दैट वी विल जस्ट इम्प्लीमेंट इवेंट ब्रिज ऑल्सो ऑन दैट लैमडा फंक्शन सो हेयर इज द डाइग्राम डिपेक्टेड हेयर सो शेड्यूल ई सी टू स्टार्ट टू कीप ई सी टू रनिंग ओनली वी हैव टू यूज केस लाइक मंडे टू फ्राइडे वी हैव टू रन दैट ई सी टू इंस्टेंस नाइन ए एम टू सिक्स पी एम सो सो सम ऑफ ऑफिस हैव रिमोट सर्वर दे ऑन दे स्टार्ट नाइन ए एम एंड आफ्टर ऑफिस आवर्स लाइक सेवन पी एम और एट पी एम सम ऑफ स्टार्टअप वॉन्ट टू सेव सम ऑफ मनी सो एट दैट टाइम इट शुड बी स्टॉप दैट ई सी टू सर्वर सो बेसिकली वी कैन स्टॉप मैनुअली ऑल्सो बट इफ वी ऑटोमेट द सिस्टम सो इट विल मोर हैंडी एंड वी कैन यूज दैट टाइम इन अदर वर्क ऑल्सो सो ओके सो हेयर वन ऑफ इम्प्लीमेंटिंग क्लाउड वॉच एंड आफ्टर दैट वी हैव टू क्रिएट आई एम रोल विच कंट्रोल द lambda server and ec2 server so starting and stopping and we have to give full access to ec2 instance and uh, that lambda server also so in one uh, lambda code we can deploy start and stop ec2 multiple ec2 instances or single ec2 instances so let's start with the uh, demo purpose okay okay so here uh, i have just open my aws account and we need to create one of ec2 server so here we can give any any name which we have to uh, which which you are comfortable with so i have given that lambda ec2 server so we can select uh, any of that uh, um, linux packages so we are just i am just choosing uh, ubuntu ubuntu is very uh, handy uh, linux distribution so so here we can uh, choose that key pair name but uh, right now we don't need to choose that so just allow ssh traffic so we can uh, communicate with the cli command and uh, https traffic we can we have to um, give access to that also and uh, http sorry for that and we can uh, this is 8 gb is by default for that any ec2 server when when you start and start to launch that ec2 server so 8 gb is minimum so we can increase here 8 gb to any uh, uh, any number you want so just launch instances here so it restrict to generate key pair name okay so so we can generate dot ppk so it takes 2 or 3 minutes to complete start so it's a pending state so meanwhile uh, we just uh, fast forward that video and uh, we can create lambda server also lambda functions okay. so create a function so first we need to stop 
that is C2 instance stop EC2 so here we can select Python uh, 3.3 3.12 so any uh, any uh, language which you are comfortable with you can select from here uh, right now I am just taking that use case Python 3.9 advanced setting and uh, here is keep it that default okay just creating the function it's in a running phase so in this instance we have to uh, find some of details that instance id generated and this public ip also generated but this ip is not a static one when you restart or uh, uh, stop and uh, again start the instance that this ip will be uh, changed so if your use case demand that you have to you you have to keep ip same so you have to select uh, elastic ip create elastic ip and associate that elastic ip to the ec2 instances okay so it takes three to four minutes okay our ec2 instance is ready to go so here function is also created so uh, we have to write code so uh, i just written this code before also so i if you uh, want then i can share this code also so here just put it here and we uh, we have to uh, watch in this code like uh, which reason your instances has been uh, deployed so here is us west 1c availability zone so reason is like uh, north california and uh, your availability zone is important for that uh, lambda and ec2 communication so here is availability zone is uh, us west 1c so uh, just keep that uh, reason is like here us is 2 and this is north california us west 1 okay so us west 1 we have to yes this one we have to give that identification in which reason we have uh, uh, generate or uh, launch that ec2 instances and here that we can give instance id so for here instance id you will get from here and just paste it okay so your application your uh, lambda stop function is now ready to go so just uh, deploy this code here and uh, we will try to test this code with either uh, some of role or functions have been uh, remaining or not so just we test first okay so it might get uh, failed yes as expected so we have to uh, look out what error has been occurred you are not authorized to perform these actions okay so here is the issue with a role so I have we haven't create that role so for that we need to go to that I am role options and uh, we, we have to give that permissions lambda basic execution is already given so we have to give ec2 full access and lambda full access also and lambda it's taking some time 
okay so we have to give a lambda full access also and add permissions and after adding we have to test again either our code is working test that cases so yes it's work it works and the function got succeeded so here you can see that that our ubuntu server instance is now stopping a stopping state so yes we have uh, generate stop uh, lambda function and connect with ec2 with creating role adding permissions and stop that instance also so in uh, go above we have to put some of uh, uh, timing boundation as well also so uh, event bridge we can use that for purpose so we will uh, see in the next uh, video and how can set up that event bridge and all and starting the instances so here for now thank you for watching we will meet in the next lecture bye mm -hmm.